In this video, we are going to explore the Qutub complex in Delhi and its architectural significances. So, let's As begin. we enter the Qutub complex, on the right side we see a colonnaded structure. On the left side is the Alai Darwaza and among these we see the magnificent Qutub Minar standing tall. The Qutub Minar is a 73 meter tall tapering tower of 5 stories with a 14.3 meter base diameter reducing to 2.7 meters at the peak. It contains a spiral staircase of 379 steps. Qutbuddin Aybak, founder of the Delhi Sultanate, started construction of the Qutb Minar's first story around 1192. In 1220, Aybak's successor and son-in-law, Iltutmish, completed further three stories. In 1369, lightning struck the top story, destroying it. Feroz Shah Tughlaq replaced the damaged story and added one more. The structure displays a marked variation in architectural styles from Aybak to that of Tughlaq dynasty. The inside has intricate carvings from the verses of the Quran. The Alai Darwaza is the main gateway from southern side of the Qubatul Islam Mosque. It was built by the second Khilji Sultan of Delhi, Alauddin Khilji. The domed gateway is decorated with red sandstone, inlaid white marble decorations, inscriptions and lattice stone screens. This is the first building in India to employ Islamic architecture principles in its construction and ornamentation. This makes the Alai Darwaza the earliest example of first true arches and true domes in India. Kuwait al-Islam Mosque It was the first mosque built in Delhi after the Islamic conquest of India. According to a Persian inscription still on the inner eastern gateway, the mosque was built by the paths taken by destruction of 27 Hindu and Jain temples built previously during Tumars and Prithviya Shahan and leaving certain parts of the temple outside the mosque proper. The mosque is built on a raised and paved courtyard surrounded by pillared cloisters. The mosque is in ruins today but indigenous corbelled arches, floral motifs and geometric patterns can be seen among the Islamic architectural structures. In the courtyard of the mosque stands the iron pillar. The iron pillar, which is 7.21 meters high and weighing more than 6 tons, was originally erected by Chandragupta II in front of a Vishnu temple complex at Udaygiri, and from there it was later shifted to its present location. The pillar bears an inscription in Sanskrit in Brahmi script dating 4th century AD, which indicates that the pillar was set up as a Vishnu Dwaj. Other than these, the complex also has other monuments including the tomb of Iltutmish, Alauddin Khilji tomb and Madarsa and the Alai Minar. Alauddin Khilji started building the Alai Minar after he had doubled the size of Qutul Islam Mosque. He conceived the star to be two times higher than the Qutub Minar in proportion with the enlarged mosque. The construction was however abandoned just after the completion of the 24.5 meter high first story core. Soon after death of Alauddin in 1316 and never taken up by his successors in Khilji dynasty. 